everybody welcome back to the channel if you haven't already please subscribe give our videos a thumbs up and don't forget to share so it's Thursday it's pretty cold this morning I got the little truck here started running try to warm up we got a load of hogs to load out so I'm gonna go ahead and head up to the farm and do that and we'll see what the rest of the day entails I got the lo hogs loaded out and now I got the semi started letting it warm up here. And I'm gonna go over to the dads and try to load a load of corn and start filling that contract. Yeah, we got the blue truck over here. Got it loading. We got the white truck over here. I'm gonna get it loaded after the blue truck. Head over. Supposedly there's a decent line. Both neighbors across the road, they're hauling out corn as well. So, blue truck's about half full. Already got the tarp off. Here on the white truck. Start it up, let it air back up. He's got the blue truck and fill them both up make sure the doors are all closed everything so we'll be back yeah we got both trucks loaded so we're heading over to the elevator dad's behind me I don't know Maybe load them back up for in the morning. Yeah, I made it over here to the CGB, and there is a long line. I got doubles all the way around there. Dad's behind me, along with about five other trucks. So there's a line. Yeah, Dad was behind me in line, but he's already emptied and heading back. My line is not moving very quick. There's a lot of guys here, though. Been here about 40 minutes. So, not terrible for as many trucks as here but luckily we don't have too big a contract yeah finally got out of there so now we're heading back dad said he was going to fill up his truck so he should be about half full by the time we get back that way we'll be ready for the morning get over and maybe beat some of the line
Good morning, it's Friday, it's cold again. I'm gonna try to finish our corn contract for January, just a couple more loads. So, checking the hog buildings right quick and then gonna go over and start hauling. We filled the trucks up last night, so we'll be able to take off. Hopefully the lines ain't quite as bad as they were yesterday, but I'm sure they will be. Well, I come ahead of Dad to see if there's any scales or a line before we both come over here and set. Got neither one. Come over here, it's oh, a little after 8.30. Get to pull almost right up here to the scale, so. Should be in and out fairly quick. So we pull up here. You got your probe here where this guy's at. You swipe your card, that's assigned to you. Put in your ticket, how you want it split or sold. Then you pull up on the scale, they weigh you, tell you what pit to go to. You go empty, pull back on the scale, see how much you weigh afterwards. Off you go. There, Dad just pulled in. Well, he'll get to cover out of the way moving through fairly quick. They're probably pretty decent line this morning when they first opened, so that's what we kind of waited. Give time guys to get out while they all go back to the farm and reload, we can come in here and not have to wait. we won't be here too long he's here about 50 minutes yesterday but they had double line player back around actually over here on the other side of me so shouldn't be near that long today yep yeah, got back home backed up got the John Deere started but it warmed up just a little bit Now starting the next load. And that should be here. Probably within the next 15 minutes or so with his truck. A couple more loads and we'll be done with corn for this month. We yeah, haven't got both trucks loaded, so now we're heading back. driver that must have missed the turn at the DC must be trying to thinking he's gonna turn around here at this intersection he was at the next intersection from here I got done there so stopped here at the red rooster gonna go in get me a drink maybe something to eat it should be about lunchtime not many trucks over here anymore so it's easy to find parking since the new loves opened up across the road looks like people still crazy about Arby's been a line for a long time when it first opened it was terrible you'd go from there 
clear back over here for people just to eat sandwiches. You go inside, it's a lot faster. I guess people just don't want to get out of their cars. So we're going to go ahead and go in here. Dad has to get his truck recertified. So he'll be doing it right there. So he should be coming here anytime. He was right behind me. So I'm going to go ahead and take my bibs off and go in. Yeah, we went ahead, got both trucks run over the test. Why we was here, just got done eating lunch, so we got our contract filled, so now we're gonna maybe go back and start cleaning out a bin. Try to support a local truck stop. Been around for a long time and money stays here local. like loves across the street I doubt other than the employees the money stays very local so try to help out your small local businesses when you can well buddy ours Casey he come and fixed the electrical for us so thanks so now we're able to run or sweep so I get to go in the bin and start sweeping Bin cleaned out, moved the auger to the other bin. Got that truck loaded before we had to move. Got about 200 bushel left we put on that truck. So now they're both full, both ready to go down the CGB Mount Vernon down by the river this coming week. So now we gotta go up and I borrowed her hog chute and brought it back so now we got to get it set back up so we can load two truckloads of hogs Monday so run up there right quick <laughs> 